I've been waiting for this one for a while, guys. It's gonna be awesome. We're gonna build a table, but we're gonna incorporate this electronic scrap into it. These circuit boards look fantastic. This is our basic shape we're gonna use right here. We're gonna use this two inch slab and we're gonna use some epoxy. Imagine that. I know, it's scary. First thing we gotta do is build our tabletop and it is very boring. Very glad that's over with. It was, it was very boring. The cat always wants to be fed on top of whatever I am working on. The cat thinks it's in charge. You're not the boss of me. Hear that? You're not the boss. Okay, first things first. Let's do a little chalk outline. See how it lines up on the slab. Not too crazy about this right here, but I think I can work it so it disappears. And this right here, I can do something with that. Top, that's my bottom. Top again, bottom again, top again. Okay, so we've got it cut in our perfect oval. Now let's take and make a template. Let's freehand it. And we'll route this out for our circuit boards to fit in. all routed. It was not a lot of fun, to be honest. Well, I'm not going to say that it went perfect, but I think it's okay. It's going to be covered up with circuit boards and then epoxy. Had a little boo-boo there. -boo -boo. We're going to take our form. We're going to use that as a pattern to cut out circuit boards to fit here. This is a good one. Ta da! Right. And to cut the circuit boards, I have to get a metal cutting good for my saw. I think it's gonna be okay. But I'm still scared to death to unwind these things. Oh. There she is. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, Blue Turtle, does that circuit board smell good when you cut it? No, 
It does not. It smells very, very bad. top's been sitting for a couple weeks. I just hadn't got back to it. Now I'm ready. Look at the ear. Okay. <clears throat> First thing I've got to do is get this crappy caulking off. It was kind of acting as a dam. Kind of. And I don't know why I dread this so much. Usually cause it doesn't. Finally, sand. I'm gonna start with the 80, and it's gonna be messy. This caulking's gonna get stuck everywhere. Okay, that's enough sanding for any video. But to cut to the chase, it's gonna take a lot. And it does look pretty crappy at this stage, but a little bit of denatured alcohol, you can clean it up. You see, it's going to be fine. Then we're going to go to 220. Then we're going to have to tape this perimeter. Then we're going to keep going. 320, 400, 600, 800, 1,000, and then we're going to polish. A lot of work, very boring. I'll show you what it looks like after the fact. This might be a good time to do some edge treatments on the top and a little bit of sanding also. Alright, for the legs, I've glued up this huge block of walnut. I'm also going to turn two legs. Let me do this. Here I go. What I'm thinking about is using this from our template that we slide it in like this. We're gonna, 
one of the biggest things that's bothering me right now is you remember when I changed that bandsaw blade to the metal cut blade? I don't want to change it back. We're going to have to see what it does. It should be able to cut this wood. Okay, got it cut out, got the edges sanded, but I'm not sure I'm liking the design. I think it needs a little bit more. This, I'm excited about, certainly. But when I cut these out with standard metal cutting hole saw, it left a crazy dimension here. Doesn't match up to anything. I gotta have some help. So I'm gonna call my buddy Greg at STL Woodworking, and I'm gonna see if he can cut me some templates and made them down here too. Barry. Hey man, what's going on? Greg, I need some help with some templates. I know you could bang them out on the CNC real quick. It's just odd little circle shapes. I can cut you something. Wait, it's not another banana table, is it? Because you already have the world's best. Nope, not a banana table. Something equally wonderful and mysterious. Thanks, Greg. Finally, finished. Thank goodness. This thing is drugged on forever. We're gonna put some Osmo on it. <laughs> <laughs>